Hey guys, in this video today, I will show you how you can export power grades from DaVinci Resolve on the iPad. Here on my channel, there was a video in the past because in the past it wasn't working and I did a workaround. But finally, they fixed this. So now you can do the just normal way of exporting power grade so you can reuse this. If you don't know what a power grade is, I will teach you now in this video what a power grade is and also how you can export that so that you can use the power grades and put it into another iPad or another laptop, however you like. You can even just save it on your SSD. If you're new to the channel, I'm Daniel. Here it's all about DaVinci Resolve on the iPad. So let's start with the video. So what are power grades? So if you come here to the color page of DaVinci Resolve, and let's say for example here I have the iPhone footage because I shot that on my iPhone. And normally what I would do is now I would create all the different notes to color correct and color grade this because iPhone footage normally looks washed out. But here on that side, if you click this icon here, you can open this. Normally you are here in the stills. If you don't see the power grade folder, you can just right click here and then say for example here, add power grade album. And the cool thing about power grades is it's basically the same like the stills folder but the stills folder is only for the stuff that you have here in your project so whatever project you're working then you can work with different uh, stills and grades and stuff like that I can save that right but the power grades is in all projects so if I find something that I do often and I want to reuse then you would drag and drop either the stuff that you created here into the power grade or you can then for example uh, apply the stuff from the power grade to your footage. So what did I mean by that? At the moment I have, for example, already my HDR iPhone stuff. So I can just use this clip here, select, and then drag and drop this into here, the note tree. And you see now here, now it makes more sense. All of the things, I don't have to do it anymore. I already did all the color correction, even a little bit of color grading. And now my video looks so much better, not washed out anymore. And the cool thing is I can go in a new project, like it in this project, and I can just apply that. That is a power grade. But now comes the question, how do we export that? And it's actually very simple. You just right click on this clip and then you see here export. And then you will open up your folder. You can even go to your external drive. I will now be just on the downloads. And also something new that they impl implemented is you can even save it now in different kind of formats here, but it makes sense to keep this one for the, for the power grade as a DPX file. So just make sure it's that. And then we can say, okay, test export great all in caps and then I just say open now this is done it's finished and if I want to import that it's now on my files I can just come in here to the power grade and say here import and then I can go back to my downloads and if we look down here I see now let's see where is it here test export grade and it will create two files and you just have to double check the sizes of the files. So the bigger one is the one you actually want to use. The other one you don't need. So if I click this one on and say now open, now this new grade is here with the name in my power grades. And now it's available in all of your projects. I hope you learned something in this video. And if you want to learn and master DaVinci Resolve on the iPad, I have a complete masterclass with all the hidden secrets, how you can do stuff that normally other teachers or other courses don't even teach you because DaVinci Resolve on the iPad is the same software like on the desktop and you can do so much things. So definitely check out the link in the description. There's a lot of bonuses involved in this masterclass as well. It grew over the last almost two years now, almost it's one and a half years. And yeah, definitely it's made for you. If you want to learn more about DaVinci Resolve, check out the link in the description. And I hope you liked this video today. If yes, hit like, subscribe, ding a ding a bam bang gong, and we'll see us in the next video. I'm Daniel. Bye.